welcome back to our channel. If you've not seen me before, I'm Robin and my German Shepherd is Kaiser. As you would have seen in the title, my dog is gonna try antler for the first time. He actually tried another dog's kind of bit of an antler a few weeks ago when we kind of visited them. Um, it was like his reunion with his best friend. So I did put that as a little short on his channel so you can have a look. But I was in Pets at Home, I saw it and I thought, you know what, I'll treat him to it. I'm away this weekend but I won't leave it with him and with my grandparents who he is staying with purely because I feel he should be supervised just in case he swallowed it, it got stuck or anything and it's a new item that I've never given to him in case he's not happy with it, allergic or anything like that but I will show you the product, the antler I got I can't remember how much it was, I think it was like £10 or £14 it was like small, medium, large, extra large size, I think I could just I just got the large to start with. To be honest, extra large didn't look much different, so I thought I just might as well get large um, and see if he likes the antler. He kind of showed a bit of interest in his like doggy friends ones, but I don't know if he will with this one. So this evening before I go away, I will give it to him and yeah, let me know if your dog has had, had antler before. It's common, but I don't see it as common as I thought it would be. I don't really know the pros and cons to it um, as much, so I will have a look and leave a list on the screen um, if I can. I will kind of give it to Kaiser, show you where we keep these treats as well and how we store things. This will kind of probably stay and then when we go out or go away, we'll take it away from him just purely because I do worry about things like that, him choking, things breaking off or him having a reaction to it or anything. So yeah, let's go and give Kaiser his antler. There's Kaiser's little booty and his bum. He's just chilling at the moment. So obviously we keep all the treats and everything in the kitchen. And this is kind of like his doggy corner. As you will see, we've got kind of jar, which needs filling up. We've got his lick mat. We keep his treats and poo bags. And this is the handler. I thought this is a better view than kind of wiggling one hand with the camera but this is the antler it is a highland antler 100% natural deer antler dog chew it says oh it has benefits on there long lasting low in fat helps with dental care no additives or preservatives from Scottish highland European deer we are from England and obviously we live in the UK eco sustainable product and naturally shed so obviously that is a thing like with antlers they shed naturally um, there's a bit more kind of details on the back the pricing isn't on here but it does say large and like the minimum grams of it so that's the details what I can do is I'll link it below on the in the description on the website if I can find it but there's all different shapes sizes they won't all look like this but some of them were really pointy and sharp and I was a bit concerned so I thought I'll get something a little bit more blunt edged um, a little bit more easier to grip for him and chew so what I'll do is I'll take the packaging off and I'll give it to Kaiser this is the antler um, it's obviously very hard um, it's not hollow there's got tiny little holes that you can see but that's it um, I'm going to see if Kaiser is interested. Come here. Ooh. Good boy, so gentle. Whenever he gets like a new toy or something. Good boy. Very inquisitive, bless him. <laughs> it's alright. I'm so sorry, the glare from the sun. Oh, and you're very close, aren't you? He doesn't really know what to do with it. Oh no, don't do that. It'll go down your neck. So I'll, I'm kind of like moving it away because sometimes he leaves things on his um, bed and then we'll go back to it later. Right, that's it. I'm not going to wait around for Kaiser to chew. I will just update you guys on Kaiser's Instagram and maybe a short on this channel. He takes a while sometimes to warm up to treats and toys. I'm also keeping a close eye because obviously with his stomach and everything, I'm very, very wary. I know people worry about splinters um, with the, the teeth of like the dogs with antlers as well. So that's something I'm going to consider and keep an eye out. If I feel it's not suitable for him, I will just take it away. 
but I know there's a lot of pros and cons and a lot of like arguments on it but look all I can do is try with my own experience my own dog so thank you for watching subscribe and yeah let us know if you want us to try any more natural dog treats any normal dog treats and any new dog toys see you later bye